Welcome to Mastering Solutions. In this problem, they want us to figure out what the acceleration is for the frog during the jump. So let's write down the equation for acceleration, which we know is the change in velocity over the change in time. Now for the change in velocity, they tell us that it has a takeoff speed of 3.7 meters per second and it's going to be final minus initial but the initial velocity since it was jumping from the ground is zero meters per second so this is our delta v the delta t same thing is it's starting the time from when it's jumping so it's starting from a zero so 60 milliseconds is going to be our delta t but they're making it a little bit more difficult on us because milliseconds is not in standard units but we can change that simply by going milli, just writing what it stands for, which is 10 to the negative 3. So 60 times 10 to the negative 3 seconds. And now we're in SI units and we can just plug it into the formula. So now we can plug this into our formula and we have 3.7 meters per second for the change in the velocity over 60 times 10 to the negative 3 seconds for the change in the time. 3.7 meters per second divided by 60 times 10 to the negative 3 gives us 61.67. So that is going to be 62, basically. So our answer is 62 meters per second squared for the acceleration of the frog during his jump.